The buzz is real. DJI's Mini 5 Pro is shaping up to be one of the most eagerly awaited drone releases of the year. Despite the recent launch of the palm-sized Mini Neo, the excitement surrounding the Mini series hasn't slowed down. That's because the Mini lineup has built a reputation for delivering stunning aerial photography in a lightweight, travel-friendly form. Now, fans and creators alike are wondering, what's next? Today, we're breaking down everything we know so far. Rumored specs, potential upgrades, and when you might finally get your hands on the Mini 5 Pro. Plus, we'll dig into the challenges DJI faces as it tries to pack more power into a drone that still needs to stay under that all-important 250 gram limit. The DJI Mini series is beloved for a reason. It offers professional level imaging and flight capabilities in a drone that's small enough to fit in your backpack, and crucially, light enough to avoid FAA registration in the United States. That sub 250 gram threshold keeps things simple for hobbyists and pros alike. But here's the dilemma. As DJI looks to push the limits with better cameras, smarter tracking, and more robust performance, how do they fit all of that into such a small package without crossing the weight limit? That's the design challenge at the heart of the Mini 5 Pro. One of the most intriguing rumors is that the Mini 5 Pro might be the first ultralight drone to feature LiDAR. For those unfamiliar, LiDAR uses lasers to build a detailed map of the surrounding environment, making it great for obstacle detection, especially in low light conditions. If true, this could be a game changer for pilots who fly during early morning or at twilight hours. But for typical daytime flying, LiDAR's advantages might be, might be less noticeable. Still, the inclusion of such high-end tech in a sub-250 gram drone would be a big leap forward. Leaked images hint at vented motors, suggesting that the Mini 5 Pro may be getting a performance upgrade with more powerful propulsion and improved heat management. This would be a welcome improvement for flying in windy conditions, an area where lightweight drones traditionally struggle. But more power usually means more energy consumption. To stay under the weight limit, DJI may need to reduce battery size or find other components to slim down. That could result in shorter flight times compared to the Mini 4 Pro. It's a balancing act and one we'll be watching closely. Early spy shots from Chinese social media platform Weibo suggest a slightly reworked airframe. The Mini 5 Pro still resembles its predecessor, but with subtle tweaks, like those new motor vents. These changes likely help accommodate new features without sacrificing the ultralight build. DJI seems to be refining the Mini's physical design to fit more tech into the same weight class. If they've pulled it off, it could be a major engineering win. Another hot rumor, the Mini 5 Pro might get a 1-inch camera sensor up from the 1 over 1.3-inch sensor in the Mini 4 Pro. That may not sound like a huge jump, but it would significantly improve low-light performance, image clarity, and dynamic range. Rather than focusing on cranking up resolution, DJI appears to be prioritizing better image quality through improved color depth and reduced noise. For creators chasing cinematic footage, especially in golden hour lighting, this upgrade could be a game-changer. Users have been calling for better tracking for years, and the Mini 5 Pro may finally deliver. Enhanced AI tracking could allow the drone to better lock onto uh, fast-moving subjects, ideal for filming sports, vehicles, or outdoor adventures. If DJI nails this, the Mini 5 Pro could become the go-to drone for creators who want high-energy, dynamic footage without needing a larger, more complex setup. There's also speculation about 5G being introduced. With 5G on board, the Mini 5 Pro could deliver ultra-smooth live video feeds, more reliable long-range control, and higher quality real-time previews. Whether you're a pro on a shoot or a hobbyist chasing epic views, this would be a major leap in connectivity. Of course, with so many possible upgrades, LiDAR, stronger motors, better sensors, something may have to give. Battery life could be the trade-off. The Mini 4 Pro boasts up to 40 minutes of flight in optimal conditions. With added tech on board, that number might dip slightly. If DJI can maintain or even improve battery life without breaching the 250 gram limit, that would be a huge win. But if not, users may need to pack a few extra batteries on their adventures. Looking at DJI's usual release cycle, a November launch for the Mini 5 Pro seems likely. That would keep them on pace with past mini drops and give fans plenty of time to get excited heading into the holiday season. Of course, the big question is whether the Mini 5 Pro will offer enough of a leap to justify upgrading from the Mini 4 Pro. Only time and a full spec sheet will tell. The DJI Mini 5 Pro is shaping up to be more than just a minor refresh. 
With rumors pointing to LiDAR, stronger motors, a one-inch sensor, smarter AI tracking, and possible 5G connectivity, DJI may be setting a new benchmark for what an ultralight drone can do. The real challenge? Packing all of this into a drone that still weighs under 250 grams. If DJI can pull it off, the Mini 5 Pro might just become the new king of compact drones. That's everything we know so far about the DJI Mini 5 Pro. Which rumored feature are you most excited about? Drop your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoyed this breakdown, be sure to like and subscribe for more drone news, leaks, and reviews. Thanks for watching.